Hey everyone, quick message I want to bring to you. For those that are being introduced to art or you're trying to become a collector or buyer for the first time, listen to me. You do not have to be educated in art to purchase art, to visit a museum or go to a gallery. When you're looking at art, you're looking at something that could be a conversation piece. You could have 10 people in a room and 10 people will have a different perspective on what this piece of art is saying. Some of the pieces, they tell stories. You know, some of them are actually talking about things that may resonate with you or may actually give you a different perspective on something in a way that you've never even thought of before. It opens your mind and it starts conversation. At the end of the day, the simple rule is buy what you like. Now, if you are buying from a museum, if you are buying from a gallery, you know, I will advise you that, yes, it can be kind of tricky because the prices are elevated a little bit based upon those people in the galleries and some of the people in the museums have hit a certain statue, a certain status, rather, in the art world to be in these galleries. You know, so it may be priced a little bit more. So the way that you would do that is you would actually find out a little bit about the artist and figure out how long they've been in the game, you know, and, and it, it, have they been putting out constantly good work? And maybe it may be a little bit pricier than most, but you know you're actually paying for somebody that will be around for some time. And you never know, you, it, it may be an investment to where the price point of that purchase at the moment will rise over the period of time. I know that's easier said than done, so stick with me. I have more videos that actually help you become a, a better buyer, better collector, and someone to when you go to the galleries, you can have more information on what you're looking at and you buy what you like.